sent. And we'll be getting a scent to then give out to the top cut. But here we go. Action John and D4C. Game one. Alrighty, so we have an inkling out here and uh, the new DLC, Pyra and Mithra. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so I can only speak for, for inkling's perspective. Um, I know a lot of the inklings can be a little bit annoyed by Wi-Fi just because some of the times they uh, aren't able to really assess neutral as well. Um, which is weird because you would think that with a move such as Roller, uh, you'd be able to really take advantage of Wi-Fi. But you're seeing right here that uh, the Action John's kind of just going in. He's yeah. getting stuck in the corner. Action John's doing a very good job of using this very new character. Even though Mithra was intended to not have particularly good kill power, we can already tell from the F Smash earlier, definitely has their own kill moves. But now that Pyra's out, pretty much anything here will kill. A down air, maybe an up air, an up smash. Whew. Yeah, a lot of devastating hits. And sometimes you can just get it like a raw dash attack. Um, or even that, like a side B. Um, and that's especially effective near the edge because it can cover your invulnerability. And you see right there, another kill coming from uh, Action John. Action John is doing a fantastic job using that toast on eggs to get back to stage. Rage is a bit active, so it might be a bit harder to get those combos going with Mithra. Yeah. Ooh, and we might even get an opportunity because now we're bringing it back to even. Really good roller there from D4C. But now that Mithra is back to fresh percent, those combos are going to be much easier to activate. But it doesn't matter if that ink gets on them because now Inkling is going to be dealing so much more damage. Yeah, certainly, certainly. With one move, that dealt around, I think, 30%. That was a lot. Mm -hmm. uh, but Mithra, again, a, a combo queen. And now, back to Pyra. So we'll be expecting a lot of uh, high damage here. Maybe went for it as well, because it, Pyra is a little bit heavier. Actually, not even a little bit. Quite a bit. It goes from 92 to 98 units of weight, so... Oh, wow. Yeah. Very hefty. <laughs> Right, Media switches back to uh, the Mithra. I'm assuming to get like a, a quick F smash. I've noticed that a lot. They'll like switch mid combo, um, just to get the quicker hits. Um, mm -hmm. It's also important to note that uh, if you're dashing and you jump within the air, you can actually preserve your momentum as you switch. So that's like another like little niche mix up that you can do with the character. You also do speed up when you switch from Pyra to Mithra. Uh, or you sw you speed up to the Mithra speed in the air. So that's also a nice little mix-up you can do. And most Ooh. definitely. Ooh. That was a great anti-air up tilt. That's gotta hurt. There we go, toast on eggs, but D4C is not enjoying that breakfast. It's getting a little bit rough for them right now, as 27% already. And Inkling is a bit of a lighter character relatively. Yeah, that's probably the scariest part, being a lot lighter. You know, that leads to a lot of uh, early kills. And you do not want to get touched at this percent. Many kill cool options that could be thrown out here. Oh. And using that switch's invincibility to get away from the crab. So smart from Action John. Making it look like they've been playing this character since day one. He's now at high percent. Let's see uh, what D4C can do. Mm. This is pretty much one touch for either of these players. But Action John already has a stock lead, so that means that... Oh, oh no. That's a two-stock win for Action John taking game one convincingly. Oh, man. D4C needs to do something if they want to be able to win this set. Yeah, for sure. You know, honestly, like, D4C had the right idea in mind near the end. Like, dash dance a bit, you know, evade. Mm -hmm. um, but it just seems like... Just seemed like Action John was prepared for it. You saw a lot of those like Hail Mary side views, just like that one right there, and mm -hmm. uh, really helped cover space. Yeah, maybe go for a bit more careful gameplay because once you get Pyra active, their recovery is significantly worse, meaning that you could possibly bait a switch and mm. get maybe a little bit of a stagger pressure going. Yeah, most definitely, most definitely. We might see a little bit of those mix-ups uh, next game after this counter pick. Mm. It looks like they have picked their stage, I think. 
So we should be getting into that soon. But remember, we do have that Macharino code XW54. If you do the exclamation point Macharino, and it'll give 50 cents to the prize pool. Free 50 mm. cents. Mm -hmm. It's free. There's a pool in the <laughs> back. <laughs> Alrighty, we're gonna get back into this match. No switches, but a switch to the stage. We're getting triplats. That's interesting, actually. Oh, and D4C is just not enjoying this breakfast. Every single time the toast on eggs comes out, it's getting rough. But oh, that triplat actually helped Action John out because of the invincibility from being knocked down. Yeah, it was unfortunate. I also think he got like the first of up air, but didn't follow through with the second hit. That's mm -hmm. also another unfortunate thing about Inkling, is that if you just barely miss the hitbox, yeah, you get weird whiffs like that. Um, it can be annoying to deal with for sure. Absolutely. Action John now has so much pressure going. This stage pick might not have been the right idea for D4C. Oh! oh well done. Ouch. This is almost a full stock lead, and one combo, and that'll be already a lap and then some extra change yeah, absolutely action john has no chill whatsoever just keeps going in with this pressure i mean when you're this far ahead you don't really need to worry about going too far because you know you just have such a huge lead that you can afford to go risky yeah absolutely and now we see a tech chase opportunity all right manages to knock off with a jab but now we see the Pyra once again, and we know exactly what Action John can do with this character. Oh my god. 101%. That is one of Mithra's few kill moves. The other one being that neutral B. The... Oh no. Oh, I thought there was going to be a downer up there. <laughs> I thought so too. I guess they were a little bit too high of a percent. And I think I saw an attempt at a footstool combo there, but not quite able to get it. It is definitely a bit of a trickier move to do. Yeah, certainly. We've seen a lot of uh, Pyramithus really innovate those uh, niche footstool combos. And once again, as said before, uh, she does have the preserved momentum when she switches, so that could also be something put mm -hmm. on deck. But that said, D4C finally taking that stock. Let's see if they can pull through. Yeah. At least taking that stock, but using that find the imposter to get them off stage. Almost killing. 180%. This is not looking good, but D4C is actually doing a good job of at least getting some damage in before the bleeding continues. You know, because just living is more than enough at this point. Yeah, certainly, certainly. And surprisingly, ooh, I was just... There's a little bit of commentary, Chris. I was like, surprisingly, D4C is living, but after that stock, mm -hmm. you know, what can you do? <laughs> yeah, it, it happens. But, you know, man, this is looking absolutely devastating for D4C. Actually, John has just got... Oh, wait, never mind. This is looking workable now. Just needs to take this stock as soon as possible, and D4C might be able to even it back up. <gasps> uh, Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, that's Four a sides. really, really good move to evade with. Yeah, such a strong option. I I can't even do that on purpose, so that's always. <laughs> I, I'm still trying to work against the visit. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh no. The Pyra Classic, the down air into up smash to finish it off. And Action John is going to be moving into the next round of winners. Man. What a way to start this day off. That was a phenomenal stock, and that was pretty much... I don't even think that was late percent, I think that was mid. Yeah, down to up smash, that was brilliant. Mm-hmm. Ugh. <laughs> that, that was devastating. <laughs> mm hmm yeah. Yeah. Hopefully we see some more exciting matches, because that was, that was amazing. Nice yeah, to see that... the character pin work.